right, folks. Good afternoon, Sunday afternoon. Hot, hot, hot. It is whoo, climbing up to the mid-80s, I would say, today. Oh, it's got to be there somewhere, 86, 87. But uh, anyway, folks, Sunday afternoon and came out just to take a look, measure, do some figuring on the new project. This is our new project. Uh, we purchased this burnt house last week and uh, yeah the lot needs some work and needs just to be cleared there's already a septic here and uh, water meter was here and they pulled it out I guess to keep it from being damaged um, electric is right here so yeah it's a it's a it's a messy project but a very nice project for us so oh got to pick up the hammer um Oh, hang on, folks. Uh, yeah, about just about when we're done with it, it will be about 1,200 square feet or so. And, uh, yeah. Oh, mercy. We actually have too many things going on right now, but uh, that's all right. Let's walk down here. If I didn't mention, we're in Campbell County, Tennessee. There is one house that is uh, back up in that area right there. And that's it. There's no one else around. We're on a dirt road. There's the paved road right there. But uh, we're on the dirt road here. And there is another house way up in there somewhere. Not sure exactly where. But uh, yeah, kind of uh, cool. Cool area. Uh, no houses down this road. There's one house down at the end of this road. Now this dirt road is basically just a circle it it comes right back out on the on the paved road but that's it folks uh there they advertised and sold this as an acre 1.1 i just don't believe it is i believe it's probably three quarters of an acre uh, or less than that more than a half acre for sure but uh, no other houses around it's kind of crazy but uh, there was a house up that driveway there and the property goes all the way to the driveway I mean right to it so there was a house up there they tore down there was another house down there they torn down another house even on down that they demolished and uh Somebody from Pennsylvania, uh, not this one, but the next one, which is right down there. Uh, somebody from Pennsylvania bought that. I guess they cleaned it up, got rid of the old house. But uh, yeah, this one here burnt, as you can see. Yeah, can't salvage anything. Now the foundation is good. We're keeping it. Foundation's very good. Septic's good water meter hopefully we won't have to pay for the water meter because they pulled it out it should be here so we'll see we'll see any campbell county is really good the utility so i ain't really worried about it but uh, that's it folks this is country life out here and uh we'll we'll be building this one and uh we'll see what we're going to do with it we're not quite sure yet but uh, yeah, not many cars come by. There's one there on the paved road up there. But uh, yeah, pretty cool out here. We love it out here now. Uh, along this bank, it's nothing but wine berries. That's a raspberry, a wine raspberry. We call them wine berries. But uh, we clean these things up twice already. Oh yeah. And yeah, come out here, walk down the dirt road. Remind me of blackberry picking in georgia when i was a kid up in swanee sugar hill that area we used to go up there it used to look just like this yeah pretty awesome out here folks very quiet pretty awesome now you do do hear some four wheelers atvs uh, running uh here and there but uh one family has actually owned all that land back in there there's houses up in there uh, probably a half dozen or so it's two families i do believe two or three families and they've owned the land forever 
well known in the uh, county, that's for sure. And uh, yeah, anyway, pretty awesome folks. Now, I would absolutely live right here in this house. If I didn't live where I lived, I wouldn't mind living right here. Yeah. Well, there's another car. It's about how busy the road is. There's a car every couple of minutes. You know, you might go 10 minutes without a car uh, every now and then. But at this time of day, especially on a Sunday, one will go by every once in a while. All right, folks, that's it. The, the new project that will have us busy. We're going to do all of it ourselves, every inch of it. Oh, well, not the HVAC. That's the only thing that we will not do. We'll let Eagle do that. And if you know who Eagle is or if you don't, look them up in Campbell County. They are awesome. That's a, I don't, they do HVAC work. Anyway, folks, we'll see you.